Welcome to the MindWave headset tutorial. The EEG MindWave is a powerful tool that accurately measures your brainwave activity and is necessary to use this program. You may purchase this MindWave at our website, Braintrain.com. First, remove the MindWave headset from the package and insert one AAA battery into the device with the positive end facing away from the battery. Please note that a battery's active use is about 8 hours, so it is important to remember to turn off your MindWave after a training session. Then attach the headband to the MindWave. Start by making sure your headset arm is down. Locate the hole at the front of the headband and insert the silver sensor end of the MindWave into this slot. Make sure the yellow strip is on the same side as the sensor and that the headband logo is on the side with the arm. On the interior side of the MindWave, above the battery, you will find a strip of Velcro that attaches to the Velcro on the outside of the headband and secures it. Make sure the MindWave post is first tilted to a 45 degree angle and then press the two Velcro strips together. Place the assembled MindWave device so that the sensor rests just below the hairline in the center of the forehead aligned with the middle of the nose. The battery post can be adjusted to rest above the left ear. Now, attach the ear clip to the earlobe securely. Wrap and secure the headband snugly by attaching the ends of the headband so that the MindWave does not easily move and is comfortable. If you are unable to get a good connection with the device, it may be necessary to prep the skin at the contact points. Dampen the tissue with alcohol and gently remove any sweat or skin oils from the forehead and earlobes where the sensor metal makes contact. Be sure to dry the skin thoroughly with another tissue after cleaning the skin. You can then put the mine wave back on your head, attaching the Velcro in the back and connecting the ear clip. For the best reception quality, make sure that you are looking directly at the computer screen and not at an angle when you're using the mine wave headset. This concludes the mine wave headset tutorial. If you have any further questions about the MindWave or how to set it up, please refer to the help section of the program. If you are still having difficulties with your MindWave headset or feel as though it is malfunctioning, please submit a technical support ticket to BrainTrainHelp.com.